Now Andy, we're right here, literally at the starting of City Centre South. What can we see behind us, of course, Shelton Square? So if you look here, you can see the pink facade. That's one of the first buildings to go. And that's one of the site of one of our first affordable blocks of homes. We bring affordable homes at heart for everything we do. We make sure that they're one of the first things. So you'll see uh, beautiful homes on the right hand side, hopefully with some uh, replica of the William Mitchell mural as well on the facade. And as you walk down, you should just be able to see the pavilion buildings peeking out at the end, some beautiful glass structures where we'll have restaurants and bars. We're now here at Rover Road. So what can we expect to see on the entrance to Rover Road and where the market is? Yeah, so on your left hand side will be new affordable homes, beautiful sort of gateway to site, some more white brick, something that we've picked out from elsewhere. And then you look down here, you'll see, you'll see a new pavilion building which will hold the three tons mural that's been relocated. And then on the right hand side, you've got an, another apartment block. And then in the distance, you can just about see the blue area of the, at the corner of the market. That'll remain. And then beyond there, you'll get a new public square and two new pavilion buildings. We're now in Hartford Street and understand clearly we've got the spire in the background. Yep. Those sight lines are going to be improved. Just yep. tell us what we can expect to see when you get cracking on this part of the scheme. Yeah, so pretty much one of the things that we wanted to love to do and, and something for the council was expose the spire so it could be real visible. So that actual coloured canopy, the tithing comes down and you'll be able to see a much better sight line. There's over 200 trees are being planted as part of city centre south, isn't there? Yeah, over 200 new trees and roughly at the moment there's about 3% vegetation in the area which is not enough to live in the new city. So we're trying to bring what's called a new green lung to the city. So 25% of the space, if you look on top, will be covered by green trees, bushes, planting. And the idea is to make sure that when people come here, they don't just come to shop, they come to stay and dwell, meet their friends and live here. Andy, thank you very much. Places for people to live, places for people to shop, places for people to visit and a green city centre, far greener than it will be now. And of course, one of the big schemes will be getting rid of that horrible barracks car park that will be gone a beautiful green garden and to make Coventry a beautiful and better place to live.